Hello friends, I'm super excited to announce that I'm finally gonna start working as a Reiki practitioner uh, at Synchronicities for now and we'll see how that goes. It's a really cool center. Um, a lot of people have been there. It's like a wellness center and they have different rooms uh, for meditations or for the healers to perform uh, their sessions. So I got my certification um, in June, back in June with Stacy. She's a Reiki master and one of my best friends. And, you know, all these months I have been practicing on family and friends and I've been noticing that this is really like my calling from my soul uh, right now because the people that I have been performing these sessions are having um, amazing positive results. Um, so for the people that don't know what Reiki is, Reiki is an energy healing technique that works directly on the energy field and the physical body and the mind. So for example, people that have, uh, let's say physical alignments that are uh, following a doctor's treatment or um, physiotherapist, your Reiki can help restore that balance and, I, and aid in the pain. Um, also in a mental level for people that have anxiety, depression, or you know just a really crazy lifestyle that we maintain here and especially in the united states uh, it can really help to promote a deep um a state of relaxation so again it will balance you know the anxiety the depression uh, as a coping mechanism to aid you know with those mental um, issues uh the difference with my sessions is that are not only reiki my sessions are very very 100 percent intuitive when i'm doing it um, I call in my spirit guides, the ascendant master that are in my team to help me perform the session with me and I fully integrate my higher self um, when I am going to perform. Uh, this is something that was done. <laughs> I didn't do that intentionally, but it just happened, you know, due to the Kundalini awakening that I have um, uh, back on January uh, that I've been like talking about it, um, kind of low-key. I'm going to make another video talking about that, what's a Kundalini awakening and how it opened all my chakras to uh, develop or awaken to these uh, intuitive gifts and being able to be a healer and help other people start their healing journey. So um, because of that, that, that I embody my hair cell when I'm performing uh, my sessions, I have been able to integrate, uh, I guess... Let's call it past life knowledge. So I have been able to integrate a technique that I didn't even know what it was. Um, but I, and I found out about this recently uh, and it's called uh, Sekem. Uh, this technique is from ancient Egypt and it was performed by the high priestesses and priest by Hathor or Sekhmet. Um, and it works very similar than Reiki because it works on like it's done with the hands and on the energy field reiki calls in life force energy to perform the sessions and transmit it to the people uh Sekem directly works at a soul level so it's directly from my higher self performing um perform performing it to the soul of the person uh, that i'm helping or that i'm assisting so what Sekem does is that goes directly to deep rooted trauma uh, inner child wounding, um, past life trauma. So when I'm performing sessions and I open the chakras, especially in the heart and sacral, well, in all of them really, I, I notice that a lot in the heart and sacral is when people get more blockages from from past life trauma. So I, so I, in, in pretty much all my sessions, I have been able to see uh, what are the deepest um, traumas that are blocking the chakras or of the person and and as you a lot of you guys know when we have the chakras block we have physical alignments we're our body is not in alignment it is not in in the balance that we need to um you know have a, a healthy lifestyle mind body uh soul as you know as as we need to have to perform you know whatever activities we need to do in in this planet and with our families and with our jobs and at a soul level too what's our purpose and our calling so with the chem uh, integrated with Reiki and shamanism, but I'm gonna talk about that one later because that's something I'm integrating from memories from uh, my, uh, Native American lives, but that's very new. So I'll make another video to talk about that. But with these two integrated so far, uh, is a really my sessions are really powerful um, because again, it targets not only 
the physical and energetic body and help relax. But if the person is willing, because there's some people that don't want to, or, or they say they're not ready to see what happened in past lives or even when they were a child or, you know, things like that. I respect that a lot. Um, but if the person is ready and want to start their spiritual awakening journey and their healing process, I am here to help because that's, I guess, my area of expertise right now. And I'm super excited to do it. I'm super excited to help my community and to work in something that is really my passion and is aligned with my destiny and my soul purpose. The reason why I came here and there's nothing better in life really that aligned to the truth of who you are and to to awaken to your soul gifts. So I am very, very excited and I feel very blessed to share my abilities and my unconditional love with the people that is willing to go see me, that is willing to start, to have the courage to start their healing journey because it takes a lot. It takes a lot of courage and it takes a lot of a lot of work. And this is a way to start and I you know if you, if you wanna start this work, if you want to you know, take the first step, I can I can coach you later on, you know, and I can connect you with a, a, a big uh, team of people that I have, intuitive girls and, and guys too, that will assist during this process. So you're not alone. If you if you want to have a spiritual awakening or is having it right now, a lot of people in the planet is having it right now. There's a lot of resources and Reiki integrated with Sekem and shamanism is on point. <laughs> okay, guys, have a good night. Thanks.